10, but well, each to their own. Because what people tend to forget is, while it's always two tiers this different, that's fine, but super ships are not tier 11. Most of them, the power gap gets with each uh, each tier way bigger, and with super ships it's not like 11, it's rather like 12 or 13. And in the case of United States, for example, even 15. Matters, matters not now, how are you doing? Welcome. Thank you for your follow. Like something like Yamagiri or Zorki is actually tier 11, but then you have Satsuma, Konde and Annapolis which are like tier 12s so or 13s and then you have the two Jet CBs which are literally tier 14. When it comes to power, it's ridiculous. I really would love that they do something about it. <laughs> oh my god, Penetrator, you're in our team. <laughs> Tatsuma or Hanofa? Tatsuma by far. <clears throat> well, Hanofa is a funny brawling ship or something. But it's not that much stronger than others. It does have the overmatch, which helps a lot. But Setsuma is just with the F button. It's like a delete ship. You just delete something with F. Setsuma, sorry. Azuma worth 3 XP? No, it's garbage. I hate it. Like he's not paying attention. Torpedoes direct front. Hi. Destroyed. Thanks for the smoke, bro. Concentrate fire on the designated target. Left in this it should be still like 20 seconds of 30. 30, okay, nothing special. Aw, oh, that's a shame. Not bad. Not a bad start, Chad. Not a bad start. Let's go to B. We're not gonna chase these two. We're gonna keep them spotted, but we're going towards B. <laughs> ah yes, the Raider Miner. In all honesty, I would like to chase the Henry. And gun him down if he turns uh, in eventually. But Henry has one problem, and that's overmatch. 
He does have two forties, which can overmatch my nose and back. So if he has a reload booster with AP, he can evapor evaporate me. If it would be two or three cruiser, I would probably go for it. But not with a Henry like this. He's gonna wipe me completely. Brizzle, you're welcome. Nia Kitovic, thank you for your follow, welcome. <coughs> I appreciate it, my friend. I appreciate it. If you want to have how many free XP do you need to regrind roughly? Harugumo is the cheapest. Yeah, Harugumo is the cheapest line to regrind. If you want the cheapest regain line, it's Harugumo. And not even, not only that, but the Harugumo line is also amazing to play. If you don't have a lot of free XP, you can stop at Akizuki and play through. It's such a joy, actually. Like, in all honesty, if you don't want to spend free XP, it's not only the cheapest one, it's also fun to play and easy with Kitakazi and Aki and everything. <laughs> like back in the day when I did regrinds, I stopped at Aki, put all my flags, all my flags on it, and got like with a match, with decent matches, like 40k XP or something. And you could save a hell lot of free XP with that as well, while grinding free XP again. Just absolutely amazing. It's going to be offline soon. Petro first. I know there's to get a cars in the back, but Petro is way more dangerous for me right now. There anyway, you can't blame me. I need to watch out about the Kazi potential torpedoes.
You wanna go gym? See you later, Ken. See you later, home. And enjoy the gym. Hands up. Too much shells. Ugh. Better run. Man, my team really does <laughs> want to win this battle by the looks of it. Fire! The rear dog. Oh, we go. Oof. Oof. Oh, Moskwa. Incorporated just subscribed. Moskwa, what the Madan fuck? Trellis, I'm gonna die Alice to Scott. you. Hey, Ronan, thank you for 23 months. Come on. Hey. Why do? Why would the Moskwa player show broadside to the entire Moment team? Sold, Literally, there's nobody here or here, and he decides to go full broadside to the enemy team. And nearly kills me with it because I can't disengage from the shells. Ay, 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 ay. Thank you for 23 months, bro. <clears throat> this is tough. This is so tough. People are desperately throwing their ships away. I don't think I can make something here anymore. Thunder is gonna get a perfect volley on me. I'm sorry. I had to turn like this. He knows, yeah. Man, that was such a good game and the team completely threw it away for no reason. We had two caps and they just went in one by one. <sighs> GG. Was a good game though. I could have probably stopped here, waited a bit longer and then Raider. I got a bit greedy there, but doesn't change the outcome. The game is lost anyway. I can't win against five people. No point. And the Pomeran even survived. Pomeran could have been dead. On 400 HP. Or f no, for 200 HP he survived. I just couldn't shoot him one uh, more. This is so ridiculous. Like, that, that game was so easily winnable, but everybody threw their ship away. My biggest misplay was this move out. I should have waited here, raided and farmed. That was my biggest misplay. Although, I, it doesn't really matter. We, lo we would have lost anyway. Still, annoying. I could have done more Oof. and maybe getting a crack. <coughs> hey, that's... Add is 79 you. just subscribed. Happy streaming, buddy. Give them hell. Smile. Thank you so much, my dude. Really, really appreciate it. Thank you. And thank you for the 15 months. Welcome back. Ronan edits. Thank you. Slowly hype train approaching. You guys are amazing. Thank you. We can actually still win it with the Pomeran. Nah. Nah. Maybe if the Balao killed the Pomeran, we could have done it. But now they're just gonna catch up and kill him. You better run, bro. The Henry's catching up. Enemy 
is about to win. Yeah, he reached his dead. Oh, come on! We had such a blast in this game and they just threw it away. <laughs> one by one, always. Now Plumar anymore? No. I'm not playing CVs. I'll play 20 submarine games before I will play any CV game again. GG. Too bad. Ah! That hurts. Really. Devastating Strike Confederates. First blood. First in the team by nearly the double amount of XP.